Sonny Donnelly, IFL TV in association with Macklin's Jim Marbella. I'm on the road today with Tommy Martin ahead of his Commonwealth title fight against John Wayne Hibbert on the 30th of January at the Copper Box Arena Stratford, live on Sky Sports. Tom, uh, how you been? Yeah, really well. Uh, just got back from MGM Marbella. So a great big shout out to the boys out there for looking after us, like always. Um, yeah, um, unbelievable. I'm, I'm in unbelievable shape. I'm, I'm ready to go. I wish the fight was this weekend. Obviously, a few of the press releases that have been sent out, John Wayne has had a few words to say about you, you've had a few words to say about him. But I think, at the end of the day, have you got a lot of respect for him? Of course, everyone knows I've got a lot of respect for, for Wayne. It's, uh, I think it's the other way around. I don't think, I don't think he respects me one bit um, by seeing what he's saying about, um, about when I said about the spars being wars. Well, don't understand. I, was, I was being respectful by saying that I was like wars. And, uh, but um, listen, if he wants to, we ain't going that way. If he wants to um, get all funny about me saying about them being wars, then let him. Did that not really get to your head then when he said that? No, nah, I just thought he was being pathetic. I thought, has he got nothing else to dig me out with? I said, that's all that he come back with. I thought, let him. Obviously, like I said, I've said this a few times against you. Uh, manpower is the question that people are asking. He is 10 years your senior. Do you think that will have an effect in the fight? Hey, listen. You've seen. You've seen. I've been performing in the gym today. Uh, I can't. I'm, I'm more than ready for whatever he brings to the table. And uh, listen, we haven't sparred for a good year, and I, I believe I'm. I'm. I'm a, I'm a year stronger and a year wiser. So uh, listen, you can't teach an old dog new tricks. Fact. What do you think gives you the key to win the fight? What makes you better than him? I, I feel I'm a better fighter all round. I feel I'm better boxing him, and. Uh, Listen, one thing that Wayne's got, he's got a big heart. He's got a very big heart, so uh, let's just see how far that gets him in the fight. That's fair enough. And how was the training camp going in Marbella? Yeah, unbelievable. Unbelievable. Uh, the boys look up, the MGM boys look after their fighters second to none, and uh, they've got me in, them and Barry Smith and Liam Price, they've got me in unbelievable shape. Um, and now it's just all about uh, bringing me back down and uh, sharpening, me, sharpening me up. How have you found the weight this time around? Yeah, brilliant. I can't thank Liam enough for it. Um, we're doing we're doing a new thing. We're eating six meals a day now. Well, today I'm eating seven. Um, drinking ten liters of water a day. It's it's brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. And, it, and have you found it easier to make weight? Yeah. Well, you see my check weight today. I think it was ten five. So. And and that was before training. That's you know true. I mean? that and, and how has the sparring gone today? Yeah, good. It was. Uh, we're, we're, I can't thank Peter Donner enough for flying back to England to help me out. Um, he's been perfect sparring for us. Uh, so yeah, just everything we've done, we've not left no stone unturned. We've we have covered every single basis. So uh, everyone's going to see. I honestly believe everyone's going to see a new Tommy Martin on the night as well. And obviously, you're hoping a new Commonwealth champion. Exactly. Uh, what would it mean for the, you to win them belts? Oh, I mean a lot. It really will mean a lot. But. Um, I don't think, listen, that's that's not what, all I want to win. I, I want to win a lot more than just the Commonwealth and WBC, you know, so I want to go on to do better, greater things than that. So, uh, but yeah, I'll, it'll be an honour to win them and it'll be an honour to be a champion of uh, of the Commonwealth as it's so prestige and uh, get a good ranking in, in the WBC as well. And it wouldn't be a Tommy, Road, Tommy Martin on the road interview if he wasn't in a new car. <laughs> Big shout out again, Jump to 17. <laughs> Got a lovely uh, little ST. Yeah, he's a nice little run this one. Um, <laughs> that's, only, that's only because my one's there. Uh, they've got my one at the minute, they're doing all my wheels up for me. They've got put four new brands spanking new wheels on it. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> a lot of people that see, I've spoke to people, and if they don't know you, that you come across a little bit cocky maybe. Arrogant. And arrogant. Why do, why do you think people see that side of you? I don't know, because they're, they're bitter. Don't hate me because you hate me! Is that, is that is that the only reason? <laughs> no, I'm joking. I don't. I don't know. I'm just listen. I'm a laugh. I, I, I like to think I am. I, I, I'm a people's person. Everyone in my area loves me. Like we get, I get on with everyone. So uh, yeah, it's, it's only when people who see me on the camera and when you get me saying stupid things <laughs> that uh, <laughs> it winds them all up the wrong way. It rubs them up the wrong way. But listen, I'm a laugh and I, I just enjoy laughing. So so does my team, and that's why. This camp, we've had such a good training camp because it's just everything has gone to perfect to plan, and I get on with every single person in my team. Where before sometimes there was issues with people didn't like people. Where this camp, everyone gets on, 
and uh, we're all on the same. We're, we all want the same, yeah, the same achievement. We all want the same goals. So uh, it's brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. So it worked out well for you. Definitely, definitely. All right, then, mate. Well, I know you're busy and you're on your way home from training, so I'll let you crack on with your day. But Tommy Martin, thank you very much. The Meat Man. TV. The Meat Man. Junction 17, my biggest sponsor, have been there since day one. MGM Marbella, my management team, can't thank them enough for being there. And Glove Gamer doing all my kit for me. Thank Big you guys. Sponsors. Cheers.